Hey everyone, happy Friday. I hope you've all been doing well and staying safe and you're excited for another edition of Friday Reads, which this week I read The Guardian by Kimberly Kincaid, which features Dominic on the cover. This is part of her Intelligence Unit series. And, <clears throat> excuse me, the first in the series featured Eric. Now this is book two. I'm gonna read the back of the book and then jump in and say what I thought about it. Guard against any danger, especially if it comes from within. Detective Matteo Garza doesn't just do the job, he is the job. He's learned the hard way that work and pleasure can't coexist. So when his little sister's best friend accidentally uncovers a money laundering scheme led by one of Remington's most cold-blooded criminals, Garza vows to keep things strictly business as he keeps her safe. Which we both know. That's not going to happen. <laughs> no matter how much the quirky mathematician makes him feel things better left buried, no matter how much she wants, she makes him want. Delia Sutton knows she's not like most people, just like she knows she needs to forget her ages old crush on Mateo and focus on survival. But the closer they get, the bolder she becomes, the more she breaks down his carefully crafted barriers to discover the man beneath. Danger is closer than either of them could possibly imagine, and no one can be trusted. Delia needs a guardian to fight by her side, and Matteo will do anything to protect her, no matter who the enemy is. What I love the most about Kim's books are she infuses so many different elements. There's romance, there's mystery and suspense and action, um, and they're very all cohesively done seamlessly within one another. And I just love that so much. I love a book that has some um, action and suspense. Um, and I love how well developed these characters are. Garza um, is very like rigid by the rules and very stringent in that way. And they call him Grumpy Garza, which he sure is. And Delia is so all about the numbers, computing percentages in her head. What's the likelihood of this if that happens? And um, what are the chances or risks of the outcome of this possibility? So she's very much in her head in that way. And I love how her character develops from being kind of meek and subdued to being very strong and take charge of what she wants. When Garza and Delia um, first meet, They've already known each other from years past, but now they're working on a case together. And while it is very business at first, obviously things develop and lead in different ways. And it breaks each of them out of their shells because now Garza has feelings towards Delia, which in some ways disrupts his job. And then Delia is letting her barriers down, even though she's in danger um, in regards to what this case is about. So I just like how they're each changing changing and growing within the story and then just how that leads them to, well, where it leads them. <laughs> but I really enjoyed this book and I can't wait to read more in the Intelligence Unit series. Um, so yeah, have you read The Guardian by Kimberly Kincaid? And what do you think about it? Stay tuned because I'm going to be having much more Friday reads coming up. And I am looking forward to reading more books this summer. Um, have a great weekend, everyone. <laughs>